Alright, so here we go. We got all the necessary materials, and we got the essential oils. Alright, so let's just upgrade this base camp to the max. And there we go. Master Builder Achievement, let's go! Nah, and you even get a broadcast too. Nah, uh, look at the broadcast. Hey, we lit, we out here, baby! Alright, so this is a guide for the Anachronia Agility course. And the whole reason pretty much you'll be going for is the various totems and of course the essential oils, which is exclusively dropped in this course. So, to even get the whole course done, you would have to have a maximum of 85 agility. It says island-wide agility course. So that's one of the other things you're going to have to have. Alright, so regarding the equipment, you know, you would bring a bladed dive switch and you would have mobile on on one of your weapons. So I got on my Excalibur and I got a laying sword. Any sword will work. The agility cape, you know what? I wouldn't even attempt to do this unless you have this because even at a 99 agility, I'm still failing like a lot of them. I remember seeing five fails in a row, so I would really recommend just getting 99 before even starting this one. Uh, Pontifex Shadow Ring, for some reason, when I put this on, I actually got the essential oils, like which was kind of weird, so I was like, hmm. And I got it on my 40th lap, so essentially that's how long it's going to take. And regarding the inventory... You know, some food, if you don't have 99. A statue collection bag, you know, because you're going to get rocks for doing agility. And also, you get golden rocks if you're, if you're doing Rhiannon's statue for trimmed. And you know what captains log for your player on ports sometimes, when they come in. Also, if you have it, you know, the silver hog boots, because, you know, they help with, you know, getting that extra agility XP per hour. Alright, so let's just get into how the course is. You know, they may, might even say, Oh, what about the look of the dwarves? Yeah, yeah, we, we got that as a, as an archaeology relic. Regarding where you use these codex pages that you get from the agility course, there's this lectern right here, so you know the lodestone, and then you'll study this lectern. And then you'll be able to make the codexes or you can make the tradable ones so I can make the double escape one so you know we'll just make it and this was this was weird too when I looked at this I didn't know there was a search button and you can actually get more pages from just searching it like like a good amount of pages you know since I already did it it then it's just gonna say it's just dust alright so we're gonna just read the double escape there we go. That's that achievement right there. And where to use the essential oils that you get from the, the course is going to be for the spa. So I need to get a lot more resources so I can upgrade it. And there we go. Alright, so essentially you would just teleport to Anachronia, Lodestone, and you would end up here. So when you go in here... You know, you would just head west and then climb up these stairs, go north. You can surge that one. You can surge. And then it'll start right here. So traverse this cliff face. Traverse. And essentially, this is going to be for under seven minutes. Because that's really what you want to aim for. Because there's also achievement for that. And, a, like, really, you can you can utilize every double surge and bladed dive all the time. Really, so, you know, you just enter the cave, cross these roots. And sometimes you're going to mess up. Yeah, that's the, that's the whole point of this. Because they made it kind of weird, so you can't bladed dive any, any which way. So you gotta, you gotta learn the ins and outs. Alright, so once you do that, traverse this ruined temple and learn it right here. 
As soon as you get down, later dive over here. Climb this ruined temple. Run across it. And as soon as you get down from here, run a little bit, later dive. And then there's going to be a point where you can surge right here. Surge. Traverse these bones. Cross the spine. And you'll also get luck with getting the codex pages, which I'll, I'm going to show you later. But yeah, once you try cross those big old bones, go one Mississippi, two Mississippi, three, and then you'll end up right in the front. It'll look like a stalled animation, but it went through. So yeah, just traverse that. And you'll see Irby Werby right here. So just keep going. As soon as you climb down this, keep clicking surge just to fly through. Go through the roots. Or traverse it. Cross the vine. And then once you make an L, do a surge. And for this one right here, you can just blade it dive and then surge right there. Make it like it's, it's almost like a V. So just to make it quick. So once down here, you do like a <laughs> you do a Samus looking symbol. You go through. A blade of dive surge like that. Jump across sunken column. And for this, you can go like this. Go right here. Blade of dive like that. Go through the door. Climb over the big block. Jump across roots. Make a surge, make it quicker. Traverse the roots. Cross vines. Cross vines again. Right here, you can surge and blade a dive. You can surge all the way down. Run all the way across, or you could blade a dive. I have messed it up a little bit. But you get the picture. Cross the vines. You can actually blade a dive that, which is kind of cool. So yeah, run across. Surge. Or you can surge and blade a dive, make it look cooler. Here, same thing. Traverse those roots. Cross the vines. And I think the fastest time I got here was what, 6 minutes 14 seconds? So yeah, you would just cross that vine, surge, cross this next vine. And then from here, just surge, blade a dive. Traverse the ruins over here. Surge. And you can surge up this. Or, you know, you just run it. Cross the plank. Surge this next part. Surge. Jump all the way down. Surge again. Blade of dive, sir. I mean, surge and blade of dive. Traverse this cliff over here. You can surge here, run up, let a dive, surge. That one's tricky. That one's really tricky. This one's cool too. Like you would just run over here. Oh, I messed it up. Oh wait, halfway. I halfway messed it up. So yeah, go over there, climb up, cross these vines.
you can surge and blade a dive here to these roots. And this one's tricky too. You can get a you can get a good surge here. So yeah. Like that. Because if you did it any shorter, it would take you a little longer of a run. Bladed dive this little part. Traverse this cliff. Traverse this cliff. And then traverse the temple wall. And there we go. Six minutes. Six minutes and 16 seconds. Look at that. That's two seconds slower than my max time. Alright. That's how you get it. Or that's how you complete the agility course.